Hey guys and welcome so today we are going to be packaging up some mail for my friend Maria she and I met last summer and um, we decided to swap I think like in May and she has been so very patient with me I appreciate it so much Maria Carmen um, because I have been behind um, and this is actually going to be my last swap because I have been so behind I want I think I just need a break um, and of course I'm going to continue crafting and designing for my design teams but I do need a break from Happy Mail. Um, so that being said, this uh, we are going to package this up for Maria. I'm so excited to get this to her um, and I think I have done some cute little projects for her this is um the only uh requirement we had was that it be summer themed um so that's pretty easy <laughs> um so yeah let's get to it so this is a polaroid camera that i have a tutorial for so you can check that out on my channel um i just added this little strap right here i thought this was kind of cute to add to the side dangle um and then in here I have some flowers, I have some die cuts. This is that die from um, Hobby Lobby. Um, I forget what it's called, I think it's a Sizzix die. And then I have these rolled flowers and I just used some Project Life cards and some double-sided tape and stuck those on there. So those are gonna go tucked away in here. And then in the bottom of this Polaroid camera, because I added this ring here, it's um, it doesn't stay flush, but I think it'll be okay. So on this bottom box right here, I have included some butterflies. I love these butterflies. I cut them out and like the three or four different kinds of paper. Um, and then I have some more back here. These are the papers that I actually used. They are so cute, right? I love these butterflies. And then with the vellum, oh, they're so pretty. And then I have these two bows right here that I think are so cute too. I love that bow die. I think I got this from um, AliExpress my one purchase that I've done on Ali, I think I got this bow die. Um, and then these little banner um, embellishments that we have all been going crazy. I think my friend April was the one that came up with these a while back. Um, and so I made some of those. So those are gonna go tucked away at the bottom of this um, camera. And this is a prototype camera. <laughs> so be patient with it, Maria. <laughs> I hope that you love her as much as I do. She's so adorable. Um, so that's that. And then I have this right here. Ah, I love this so much. I made this for a design team project using an SVG file for them. And Oh my gosh, it, this came out way better than I expected it to. I think she's so adorable. Her name is Peppy Pineapple. <laughs> I want to say Peppy the Pig, but it's Peppy Pineapple. Um, so in here, I have lots of goodies. I don't even remember what I have in here, but I know that they are cute. So first up, we have a lot of fun shred. I have the, this chunky glitter and these um, flat round sequin that match that chunky glitter. And then I have these gorgeous um, charms. Aren't they so cute and summery? I hope she enjoys those. And I think I'm not gonna put these in there because it's kind of getting too squished, but 
These are just some, a little bag I received in some Happy Mail, and these are those puffy, um, some of those puffy stars. I'm not gonna take them out of there. You know, you get the idea. Um, so I'm gonna stick all of this back in. So this is how Peppy the Pineapple will be packaged up. I just stuck her in this little bag and tried to make it kind of squarish um, in here. And then this is gonna go in here and we are gonna package this up in a baggie as well. I'll do that at the end though. And then I have this right here that is Peppy's little sister. <laughs> it's so cute, right? Um, so these are free SVG cut files that you should be able to pick up at Barely Art. I'm having some coffee because um, it's early in the morning. I really need to um, record this and get this out for Maria. So you are going to be able to pick up these SVG files, uh, if not already, pretty soon. This is just like a little sneak peek. Um, and so what I did is I, um, oh my gosh, I can't even speak it so early. <laughs> I um, welded them together to make a memory dex card. There you go. <laughs> That's what I did. And so this is what it looks like on the back. This is what it looks like on the front. And it's just like die cutting. Um, you know, you're doing like paper piecing. So this is two layers right here and then two layers on the mouth. I just added some dots to the eyes. Um, the file actually comes with little dots that you can cut out and add to the eyes. I love Peppy's glasses. I think they're adorable. I added some glassy accents to that. Um, and then I just put sweet together. Super cute, right? And this flower I love. I do not use it enough, but I, I love it. It is a Coco and Reno dye, and I just think it's so cute. So this is going to go in here, and I have just added some... Um, little flower bits in there as a little shaker mix. So that's gonna go in there. Then in this bag right here, I used again some Project Life cards and I just added the um, rosettes to this with some double-sided tape. There are three sets of rosettes in here and then I just cut out this bag topper and use some double-sided tape to add that to the top of this baggie. This bag is um, from my Creative Mojo, uh, that subscription box kit. Um, I keep all of the baggies from subscription boxes so that I can reuse, and even the boxes. Like, you really wanna get your money's worth, right? <laughs> oh, and look, I cut out some extra um, bag toppers for her. There's about four in there. And then this is a cosmetic bag from Dollar Tree. I love this bag. Every time I see them, I pick up as many as I can find because they're awesome for Happy Mail. It's a quick, easy, cute way to send a package. And so all I did was add a piece of the paper from the collection that I was using. I used Garden Party for this and a sticker that says you make today better. I don't know if you can see that. And so that's how I embellished this um, bag. And then in here I have the Simple Story sticker book. I got these from Peachy Cheap. Um, I have these beautiful stickers um, from Hobby Lobby. I love these stickers so much. And then I have this little clipboard. I actually just recently received this little clipboard from my friend Faithy and I just thought it was so perfect for this so I added this little flag embellishment I added this little um, charm dangle that I received um, in some happy mail and then I made her these gold foil um, labels I think there's about 
30 in here and it says handmade with love by Mari Carmen super cute right and then it just has like a one of those pretty paradise leaves <laughs> super cute so that's gonna go in here next up I have this little tea box again Mari Carmen this is a prototype so you need to be very delicate with this um, I hope all of this makes it to you in one piece. <laughs> but I absolutely love this box. I think she is so adorable. I love the paper, the color combination. Everything about her is so cute and small. And so in here are just little pouches and sequin mixes that um, and stickers that Mari Carmen can use to create her own little tea bags. Um, I, I sent some little vellum tea bags in here and just all the little bits and pieces that I used um, to create to this one right here. I sent her a few of the items in here. So it's just a cute little tea box. Um, Cause what is summertime without tea, right? Iced tea. So I am currently hosting a ribbon and lace and trim challenge so I decided to send her this card right here of this pretty um, lace I love the color of this lace and it's got this cute little um, pin with these three charms on there I have a novelty pin of course and it's a mermaid theme since we're doing summer I have one of these jelly bags, which I think are so adorable. I love this jelly bag. I just added some of this trim on here and this little um, charm dingle. Um, I love these little charms. They are so cute. It's a little sandal and a butterfly and some and a flower. I received these in some happy mail. Um, and then what do I have in here? I have these flower stickers. I don't want to take it out because I think it's in there so perfectly. Some simple stories ephemera. And I have this right here, um, which is just some happy beads that I also received in some happy mail with these right here from my friend Christina. Thank you, Christina. And then I also have some um, flowers in here, some little felt flowers. So I think that's very summerish. Hope she loves that. And then I have this box right here. It says sweet treats on it and happy mail on the tag. And in here I am sending her some bows and this little jar of um, charms. I think I put like four or five charms in each of these and some of them maybe more. <laughs> and each of these little containers. So. This one has some cupcakes. Let's go through it real quick. This one has some cassette tapes. Ah. This has sunglasses and cherries. Skates and hearts. And finally, we have some stars and a little Starbucks cup. <laughs> different kinds of stars in there so all of these are little charms these are beads that I picked up from Michaels and I just think they are so cute I like the iridescence of them so I went ahead and added a few in there these are some really pretty beads from my creative mojo wholesale kit these are some really cute Starbucks charms and these bubbles that are my favorite I love these so much, you guys. <laughs> they are so cute. And then I had these little roses in here that I received in some happy mail and I think they're just so pretty. And then a whole bunch of little pom-poms. So that's gonna go tucked away in this box. And then in here, I have this little Walmart ring that has a sequin mix in there. And in this bag, what do I have? Oh, I have some tool, and then I have this box right here that I added some bows to that are made out of ribbon, and I got that idea from my friend Lacey. She sent me a box like that, and I just thought it was so cute. 
so I wanted to recreate that for Maria so I'm gonna try to package all of this up and put it in a box and um, I will be right back okay so this box excuse me is really really jam packed <laughs> and I hope that I don't break anything in packaging this up so I don't have too much space for too much shred but I did put in these little curly cues because I think that's super cute I'm gonna put in this card right here I decorated the box a little with some pretty summer color um, paper and she is ready to go. Oh, I didn't even show you how I packaged up everything. <laughs> um, so this is the camera right here. I just used a gift bag for the front of it. And it's literally just in a plastic bag. Um, and then everything else is just in clear little baggies. Um, and then this is gonna go in here. Love this shred. I received it in some Happy Mail from Faithy recently, so I'm gonna go ahead and use it in this. And Maria, we are almost to the finish line. This is almost in your hands. I can't wait for you to get it, girly. So I will share this video as soon as Maria has received her lovely package. Thank you so much for watching and I will talk to you soon. Bye.